I'm Natalie for University TV, and here with us today is Johnny Thunderbird, and we're touring St. John's University, located in the heart of Queens. Now, we're in New York, so there's no time to waste. Let's start the tour. St. John's University has multiple New York campuses. Today, we're visiting the Queens campus, which is located in the most diverse county in the U.S. The campus is just 11 miles east of Midtown Manhattan. The Queens main campus sits on 100 lush acres and is gated, while STJ also has campuses in Oakdale, Staten Island, Rome, Italy, Paris, France, and the Manhattan campus located in the heart of the financial district. Want to discover New York? STJ offers an intro course to living and learning in the Big Apple. The course focuses on the themes of immigration, race and ethnicity, religion, wealth and poverty, and the environment. What better place to take a field trip to than New York City? You know, we send them to museums, uh, we go to off-Broadway shows, we took a tour of the financial district, so we can kind of give them an exposure in terms of what New York has to offer, but also tie into what St. John's has to offer them from an academic level. We approach study abroad in a very unique way. Our students, for example, discover the world of Europe, and they discover the world of Europe through three unique lenses. Our Rome, Italy campus, our Paris, France location, and our Seville, Spain location. Some students even make it to about 10 countries in one semester. In addition to Rome, Paris, and Salamanca, I've been to Egypt, I've been to Amsterdam, I've been to Ireland, I've been to London, Liverpool, and so many different unique places and so much to learn. And it was just a great experience to see different cultures, try new foods, and just step outside of the New York world. STJ has a total of over 21,000 full and part-time undergraduate and graduate students. 43% are male and 57% are female. 45% of students come from diverse backgrounds and 46% are Roman Catholic. Pen and paper? Who needs that when you get a free laptop? All incoming freshmen get one. Score! Let's see. stjohns.edu. Check it out. To be considered for admission, most majors require an SAT score of 1087, math and verbal, or 23 to 24 ACT composite and a 3.2 GPA. However, these figures vary by program. STJ is a private Catholic school, so tuition is set for all students. Students will pay just shy of $35,000 with the option to enroll into a fixed rate program. Reuben board fees range from $10,500 to $16,500 annually. St. John's offers over 100 different degree programs with 33 advanced degree options which lead to master degrees. Just a few student favorites are pharmacy, accounting, psychology, and mass communication. St. John's also offers accelerated three-year bachelor's degrees and five-year bachelor's and master's degree programs. St. John's students get the opportunity to get real-world experience before they graduate. The Financial Fund Program allows students to use the school's real money, $2 million to be exact, to use in the stock market. I have no idea what any of this means. The university offers an internship program that matches you with an array of top New York area employers like Madison Square Garden, Ernst & Young, Sony, the CIA, and the NYPD. So how are the faculty here at St. John's? pretty cool. <laughs> what I really love about the faculty at St. John's is that they really make an effort to get to know you. And so it's not just that they're available to talk to you, but they actually like try to learn your names before class. St. John's Red Storm competes in the Big East Conference at the Division I level in 17 sports. The men's basketball, soccer, and baseball programs help gain them national prominence over the years with the famed Wonder Five and several runs of the College World Series. So you guys are pretty stellar at basketball here. St. John's University has a storied basketball program, but we're not only about basketball, we also have an excellent academic tradition. Over the last two years, we've had six Fulbright winners and one Goldwater recipient. Wow, so you guys are good on and off the court. On and off the court, yes. On the weekends, I get to go out in the city. Our men's basketball team plays at Madison Square Garden, one of the greatest arenas, so it's definitely something like I love to enjoy on the weekends. It's a great time. St. John's offers eight residence halls and townhomes with suite style housing and the best part, floors are broken down by gender. All facilities have a laundry room, free laundry by the way, internet access and cable TV. STJ offers about 180 student clubs among the campuses from academic related, religious, cultural to media and Greek life. Plus they have intramurals and club sports like boxing, bowling and equestrian. 
Eye of the Storm is a student-produced TV show that broadcasts news and sports to the campus. How did I do, guys? The Torch ignites students' passion for writing. It is the official student-run newspaper of St. John's University, founded in 1922. Some notable alum include the man credited with inventing the world's first money fund, CEOs of major companies, the founder of Vitamin Water, as well as many corporate execs, former governors, plus athletes like Meta World Peace, Ron Artest. Think you've got what it takes to weather the storm? St. John's provides you all the tools necessary to succeed in the real world. So check it out for yourself. Thanks for joining me and Johnny Thunderbird on our tour of St. John's University. For University TV, I'm Natalie, and it's time for us to have some fun at the carnival. I'll see you guys later.